Welcome back to another episode of the Basement Brew Review. As you may notice, we are not in the basement and we are not at Justin's House Brewing. In fact, we're coming from uh, coming to you from Airbnb Brew Review. Yes. It, okay, we're in California, <laughs> so this is going to be a slightly different series. Probably, hopefully, we'll hit up a couple of breweries, maybe get a couple of more episodes in. But uh, you know, you've got the four of us here. You can see Tyler got himself a bit of a tan mm -hmm. and purple hair. <laughs> and purple hair. And purple hair. But uh, on a serious note, we'd like to welcome our friend uh, Matt from San Diego because Tyler couldn't be here to join us. So. With that being said, the intro for this season, I suppose, we are doing Mayan Bourbonic from Cascade Brewing, an Imperial Porter aged in bourbon barrels, cocoa, cinnamon, cayenne, pepper, and, and dates from 2017. Ooh. Dates? I've never had a beer with dates in it. I've never had a date, so. Neither have <laughs> I. Wait, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> And with, and with that, with that yeah. cheers. I mean, it, this does not smell like a porter at all. It smells like a lot going on in there. Just to ah. Ooh. I like that. Oh. That, that's like, that's good. It's almost like, like a goose. Yeah. 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 It's got a little bit of sour on the yeah. back end. Yes. Now that definitely, is, that definitely is, soured in a good way. This is mm -hmm. yes, a Northwest Sour Series. And it's a well, 2000, makes sense. You said 2017? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Very very of our bourbonic plague blend, my bourbonic, features sour imperial porter aged in bourbon and wine barrels with dates for up to two years and infused with Peruvian cocoa powders. This is what I get for only reading part of the label before right. we actually like see <laughs> Inspired by the traditional drink of the ancient Mayan civilization, my bourbonic delivers notes of bitter chocolate and cinnamon with a mild can, spice, and delicate carbonation levels. I was gonna say it is more carbonated than used to what's, what's, uh, what's the APV? That's the best reading you've ever done. Probably. Like it was eleven something. It was eleven something. Yeah, it wasn't too high. Eleven point three. Yeah. <laughs> it's not too <laughs> too high for him. Yeah. Matt's yeah, 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 yeah. from San Diego. He's used to getting the big that, body here. That, 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 that does not taste like eleven point three. No. No. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's got that. I like the the correlation with the uh, uh, ghost because it has that, that bubbliness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I would say goose. Goose. G u g u e z e. Oh, goose. this reminds me of ghost. Goose. A, a ghost dry, is different than a goose. A dry Irish stout, which you can't stand, but yeah, it's a stout, but it's light. Like you don't like it. It's unexpected. So you're just like, I really, really enjoy that. I could drink that whole bottle. I was say this is a very dangerous beer because mm -hmm. I could just drink this. Like, but, but it's really like. But I don't know if that sour would get you we, at the end. We, we I, I like sours though. So okay, like, I, I could drink this. Like for we we bought another bottle from the series. Didn't we? Yeah, the yeah, regular, regular bourbon. bourbon okay, okay, so we'll have that one coming up next. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Okay. Don't go away. Next but, week. Come in next week. I mean, the beer is four. Next week. Same same clothes, but next week. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It's a uh, beer's four years old. I don't. I don't like hot beers. I don't get a lot of heat. Maybe no. just, like, just a little bit on the back end, but not very much. We've had four year old beers that were meant to be four years old. Yeah, and it was not a good time. No, no, that's that's good. I like that one. Yeah, so that's pretty exceptional. All right. Yeah. Okay. So what what numbers? You want to start out with numbers? Uh, it's on a five CR, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So for me, this is like a four point seven. Like I, I really yeah. enjoy this. This is up there. Like. Okay. Yeah. It's good time. I, I'm saying 4.7. 4.7. Four five. I mean, I think it's an excellent beer. I mean, you start getting above that four or five range for me, and that's that's yeah, I know, yeah, yeah, almost yeah. life altering. So well, I mean, that's, that's, that's what I'm saying. Because only you given one beer above a four point five. Yeah, I mean, it takes a lot. Yeah, it, it takes, takes a lot. lot. So four, but this is solid to me. This is this is good. Very, very good. Thank you. Yeah. I, See, I was I was in the back of my mind. I was going to go four nine. I was going to go four nine. Do it. No, do it. I'm going four eight. Okay. I'm going to say I'm going four eight because this is just. To me, this is just, it's, I, I don't know, it, it tastes almost nothing like a porter, but yeah. I, I like, I just, I really like the flavor, yeah. and the, for it being the ABV it is, the flavor, it's just, I it's really, cool. I, yeah, I really, really like it. Yeah, it's good. I'm going to buy another bottle. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm going to buy another bottle. <laughs> We're here for another day. Yeah, you're checking a bag, so we should be good. I'll put that bag. I'll put a soft side bag. I just put a soft side bag. Just make sure you're in the center. <laughs> wrap it, wrap it thusly. All right, well, on that note, everyone, may the brew be with you. God, this is really good.
Like What's going to be our finishing line in this one? You know how we always like, you know, you fade out, there's like some random... This, you know, this is what we're doing it right now. This is as good as we can. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah.